All right, guys, here we go. What's up, everybody? Warlug here. Welcome back to the channel. So today we are starting with seven days to die. Now we are live streaming. We're going to be doing a video series for this on uh, my channel. We're going to be doing solo and our group content, which should be pretty sweet. Uh, New Axe didn't play. I, I, yeah, Abe was the other one. Uh, so guys, I'm going to just take you through my playthrough, my kind of a let's play. This is kind of a forgotten lore inside of YouTube and gaming. But uh, we're going to do this and just have some fun. I really do appreciate all the comments down below. Definitely help me out, guys. It's been a while since I played seven days. Um, but now 1.0 is out and everything is here, so we're going to get popping. So tutorial challenge. This is the experimental. So a lot of new stuff is here. Um, they got some really cool things here with the challenges, which is something you should follow right away. So we're going to go ahead and redeem this. Now, you do get these challenges as you persist and go through the game. And there's going to be some for everything. Crafting, traders, harvesting, homesteading, right? Basics of survival. Now, once you complete these and gather, you can track it. You can have these tracked up, which is cool. You can have one quest tracked at a time. And then once you do it, you do have to... Uh, redeem it otherwise if you spend the resources and it goes away you will have to find the stuff again but one really cool thing is the tool tip i really like that they show you where the stuff is that you're really looking for which is cool um but let's gather some shrub now we do need stone so this is great we're gonna go pick this up pick this up cotton plant i don't think i need that actually get rid of that yep don't need that pick up pick up I didn't pick it up. So you guys can see that I can now go into my my challenges here and I can redeem this. Now, if I was to lose any of my stones, so for example, if I go in and just drop my stone, so now you can see that uh, in my challenge, I can't redeem this anymore because I got to get the small stone. So give me my stone. Where's my big hunk of stone? Oh, it must have went away. That's a bummer. Oh, there it is. Five stones. So now we'll go in. We'll craft our stone axe. But first, let's go make sure that we redeem, okay? Let's redeem this first. Then we'll go in and craft our stone axe and get popping. That's right. Yeah, it was Abe guys that played. Yeah. We lost two servers. Ooh. That kind of sucks. All right, let's go in. Losing the servers is kind of a bummer. But we're going to get popping, and I'll continue this game every single time I play, whether it's live streaming or just recording. That way I have something to play off screen. Uh, we need stone. Where'd that go? Where'd that little? There it is. Oh, oh, one hardcore with Twitch integration and one softcore. Oh, you host. Oh, okay. How do you do it with Twitch integration, Dahlia? I didn't even know that Twitch could do that. All right, we're going to go, boom, let's go craft primitive armor, which is sweet. Then we can go to our character and put this on. What is this tab? Challenges. Redeem, redeem. Craft a wooden club. Get rid of, bam. Ooh, we actually already got honey. Sick. Go back to challenges. Redeem. Craft a bow. Oops. Just cooking along here. I don't have any arrows yet. So we got to find some arrows. Chrysanthemums. All right. Okay, so we got a car over here. Aha, a nest. I love it. Get another one. We'll craft some arrows. Craft stone arrows. We're going to just craft all five, which is great. All right, go into here, redeem, and then boom. So once you get to your first basics of survival, once you get done, the last quest is going to, you know, you redeem that, and it's going to give you a little message here, White River, boom. And it's going to give you our very first settlement. It takes you to your very first settlement wherever you're at. So that's where we're going to go, and we're going to try to formulate a base, or hopefully there's like a city or something nearby. That would be sweet. Um, so hopefully we have something here, but let's head on over, uh, to this trader and hopefully we find something really good. Um, like hopefully we get some good quests here initially after completing your, um, 
basics of survival challenges you want to come straight here and then just start doing quests with the trader because the trader is going to give you the most resources uh yeah let's just beat this guy in the face yeah back up back up sucker yeah that's right uh-huh that's right you're dead give me that exp baby they're dedicated servers so the twitch integration gives you the dedicated server interesting there's a biker over there. That would be good. I better change that, huh? Ooh, a biker. Oh, I only got five arrows. That's not good. These bikers are beefcakes, dude. They're they're strong, man. They're beefy. Oh, boy. We got to be careful here. I don't want to take any HP. And I figured out how to gain water back. There's like a little... Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, okay. He was getting a little... Yeah, he was getting a little funky there, wasn't he? All right, so we're at the trader. Let's see what he's got. Let's get in here. Oh, I got you. Okay. All right, we're at our first trader. Let's talk. He's going to give us a stone shovel, which is good. And then we're going to go in here, and this is where you can do quests, which is great. So buried alive. Let's accept. So when you're doing, when you're when you're at the traders, the they're going to give you quests, which is going to give you a lot of really good items um, when you do quest turn-ins on top of a crazy amount of XP. So let's head over. Oops. Where's the exit? There we go. We're going to head over and complete our very first task, which is awesome. So then actually when we go to the map... We got Trader Wreck here. Boom. Typically, we would want to build our base close to this guy because, you know, we're going to be doing a lot of quest turn-ins. So, but we'll see what happens. We need to do as many quests as we possibly can. And we need to find a city. While he's wearing a helmet war, hit the biker bikers in the junk. Okay, I'll do that. Oh, crap. What the heck? He's jumping all over the place. All right, sucker. Yeah, that's right. Hit him in the dick. Nice. All right, let's see. He's got a bedroll, which is nice. I'll take all that, I guess. Ooh, he's got some pills here. All right. Ooh, a splint. That's kind of nice. All right. Let's head over. I want to kill as many zombies as I can. We need eggs. This is really good. So guys, we went over. Sorry for if sorry for in the recording, but we did go in and we completed our very first quest. Um, it was a it was a digging quest. So I'll once I'll get another one and show you guys how that works. But we redeemed that, and then we did level up and we came in here and added some skills. I'm starting off with. Uh, we go over to perception. I went with lucky looter, so I leveled up my points in lucky looter so how this works is you can see that the perception level is five for the next one so this was level one and then your perception skill is actually at the top so when you go to upgrade like this one needs perception level five so i'll come back up to perception level i'll level these up and then i can go back down to lucky looter and level up the next one so we did complete the quest so now we're going to come back and turn this in all right, boom. So we're going to turn this in. When you're turning in a quest, you get to see all the different types of rewards that you can pick from on top of your XP rewards and any other bonuses. So you can pick one, and um, these are all guns from the very first one. I'm not really sure which one to pick. I think the machine gun is probably the best one or the shotgun. What do you guys think? Which one should I take first? Should I take shotgun, machine gun, or is the pistol better? So a lot of these correspond with like perception for uh, the uh, pipe rifle or the the rifle um, intellect for the baton pistol is agility the uh, machine gun is fortitude and then the shotgun is strength. Um, hmm, I'm thinking the I'm thinking the machine gun. I think the machine gun is really good. So let's take the machine gun. 
And then he does have an inventory, so you can see with this, every time you complete missions, he does give you gold. Um, so we're going to go into the inventory. Let's go ahead and open. And now we got a machine gun with 15 rounds, which is super cool. Um, so now we got a machine gun on here. The shoddy is a good option. So let's go to, do you have any jobs? So we got another buried one. So that way I can show you guys what your very first one is. So let's go knock this out. Let's go ahead and get this ready. All 15 rounds, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, my chat is telling me it's a 5% chance to got honey. And we got honey back to back time. So that's really cool. All right. We are here at the quest. We're going to start it. Switch to our shovel. And then we're going to dig. So this is what your very first quest will look like. This is my second one. But I wanted to show you guys the dig quest just so you guys can see. But yeah. Oops. Get rid of that. We're close. As long as your infection is uh, below 5%, one honey will work. No, no, no. Um, Dolly, I mean the percent chance to get one. Like, what's the chances of getting it from the stump? Is it always 100% to get one? All right. Let's make sure that we, we, make, we dig a way to get out of here. Yeah, let's go. All right, we found our buried stash food. Let's get this. So we got another one of these. We got the White River to turn in for the quest. We got a book. So we got everything. Oh, God, this is bad. I might die. Okay. Whew. When you finish the quest, zombies spawn. Oh, my gosh. Be careful. I almost died. Okay, bro. Yeah, that's right. You like? Oh, yeah. You like that? I love the music that they put in it. And my bow is all messed up. What the heck? <laughs> what is wrong with my bow? My bow is all jacked up. There we go. I hear you over there somewhere. Wow, you're a tough one, huh? All right, where's the last one? Did I kill him already? Okay, holy crap, dude. Intense. All right. Talk to the trader. So we're going to get 5,000 XP for this one and 250 coins. Oh, my God. Oh, no, we want 762 ammo. A first aid kit is pretty good. God, what should we take? Chat, what should we take, man? That's a one time, but we get 60 rounds for our gun. The cobblestone rocks are pretty good, too. The first aid kit is actually pretty nice. It's the only way I have to heal myself besides, like, food over time. It stops bleeding. I'm going to take that. All right, let's grab another job. So let's go with the one farthest away. Let's go. Oh, 1.4. Yeah, I guess we'll clear zombies. Maybe that will take me to the town. Maybe that will take me to a town. All right. Traders, redeem. Sick. And did we gain any experience points? I got one. So we need to go ahead and grab that. All right. So now we got a long way to go. Holy crap. 1.4 kilometers. All right, we did get a book. So whenever you guys get a book, as you guys know from playing, that this is going to improve some of your skills. And there's a lot of skills that you can only upgrade from reading. So learn to cook dozens of meals. Meals. So let's go ahead. It improves our food crafting skills. So let's let's use that. Excellent. Fire pit lodge. It's locked. We got to get in there. Where are the zombies? It's day one, man. I just killed one. I'm thirsty now. There goes a the zombie. Uh. It sounds like there is a bunch in here, too. It, wait, 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 wait. Ooh! 
Uh, I got me a haunting knife, dude. Ooh, get ganked. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I chopped her head off. Oh. Okay. All right. We got to We got to clear this first. Fancy toilet. I hear them. I hear the zombies. Oh. Oh my god, he tried to sneak up on me, bro. Chopped his head off. Holy crap, there's so many. I did not want to have to bust this out. Holy crap, dude. All right, where's this last guy at? Stabby McStab Stab. That's right, dude. Whoa, 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 whoa. Holy crap, dude. What is up? Goodness great. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, my God. Uh... I don't know if I need, if I need to take any of that right now. I don't really have the... Use, um, I will take all that though. This knife is awesome. Oh, search trash. Okay, some cloth. I know there's one more zombie somewhere. He's got to be upstairs. Give me some food. All right, that'll that'll work. Coffee's nice. All right, nothing else there, really. I don't want the sandwich. Yo, LMG, what's up, man? That does not help. Okay. Aha, there you are. Get ganked, son. That's right, sucker. Get ganked. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Ultimate gank, bro. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. What's this? I mean, I guess I'll take it. There's nothing else in here. Ooh, books. Just regular paper. Okay, let's finish checking out this house. Dude, I would love a wrench. Oh, God. Ooh, nice little pie. Nice, more pie. A lot of bones. Oh, nice, dude. We got, we got the cooking grill. That's fantastic, bro. Uh-uh. Oh! Ow! 
Ow, ow, double ow. Oh my god. What the? Dude, this knife is amazing. Dude, this biker won't die. Oh my god. What the heck, bro? Short on money improves seed crafting skill. Nice. Oh my god. What was that? Goodness, man. Holy crap, dude. Ooh, nice. Another one. We'll use this for power attack. And then we'll use this for medical crafting. So that's good. All right. So he dropped in from upstairs. So there's still... There's something up there. So let's... Oh, God. Oh, oh. Oh my god, did you guys see that? Did you guys see what's up there? Time to go gank gank, bro. Gang gang. Dude, this blade is so cool. All right. The last one fell through. Sorry, man. You tried. Wait, is there one more? Oh, man. All that for nothing up here. That actually could be a really good spot to... Uh... Oh, that's a nice little climb up, huh? Oh... Okay. Bookshelf. Nice. Huge. Repair tool crafting. That's huge. Where are these guys? Aha! That's the room I was looking for. Just gank gank, bro. This is this is what we were looking for right here. Food. Nice. Books. More books. Nice. We got assault rifle crafting. Armor rifle crafting. Alright. Pile of meds and bullets. Lead. We got another book for medical crafting. That's actually huge, by the way. I need to lock... Lock picks for that. We got a big weapons bag up here. Shotgun weekly. Gosh, I should have taken the shotgun. A rad mod. So we got a crack a book, which is pretty insane. So we're going to crack these open. We might have to stay here for the night. We got robotics here for hydraulics. And we also got robotics. Okay. Okay. Then we got Savage and then Passing Gas. Let's see what we can get in this, man. All right. We got Maintenance. Learn how to care for your bat. Ooh. Okay. And then we got Bow Crafting Skill, which is huge. It's not bad. Very, very good. We're crafting. We're popping off. All right. And then we got another one of these for harvesting craft skill. That's our second tool digest. We will take the oil. All right. So now if we go into our challenges, we got this. We'll redeem. Um, and then I think if we scrap that and then we go to tools, I think, yeah, we're on level two and level two. So we'll scrap both of those. We'll craft both of these. I can't loot the toolbox demon because it's locked. So I can't I can't loot it. 